Hi guys, Andre from Conveyor of Randomness here, and today I'll be looking at this charging dock for the Garmin Vivo Active 3 and 4 smartwatch. If you purchase a smartwatch, then you'll know the out-of-the-box charger limits you to no other functionality apart from just simply charging the smartwatch. But with a charging dock, your smartwatch functionality increases, allowing you to be able to not only charge your smartwatch, but to use it as a useful indicator of the time or a better reference tool when you're not wearing it compared to when it's charging with the standard cable. This is the Cavern Black charging dock, which is compatible with the Garmin Vivo Active 3 and 4, as well as the following Garmin smartwatches, which are listed here. The cable that comes as standard with the Garmin Vivo Active 4 is so short, that on most bedside tables it wouldn't even reach the floor from having the Vivo Active charging in the middle of the tabletop. And when it's plugged in, positions the Vivo Active in this awkward position that doesn't complement the amount of money that you've outlaid for the watch. So, you need something to complement your Vivo Active, right? That's where the charging dot comes in. You can now add some style and presentation when your watch is charging. Whether it's at your bedside, where it can be positioned anywhere, thanks to the USB cable that's almost three times longer than the standard cable, to make those late night searches for the time or to see whether it's still charging. A lot less of a mystery. Or on your desk, plugged in and next to your PC when you're exporting data from your Vivo Active to your computer, while at the same time simultaneously charging it. It has a simple but effective black C-framed look. The frame is made from a durable matte coated aluminium that doesn't leave any highly visible fingerprint marks on its surface. The section that houses the watch connector is made from plastic and the base has four rubber feet that allow the whole dock to sit nicely on the table surface without the fear of scratching the surface. The connection between the charging dock and the Vivo Active is quite clunky, but that's also the feeling you get when you use the standard charger cable. Despite this clunkiness in connecting to the charging dock, the heart rate sensor on the back of the Vivo Active and other Garmin watches will fit nicely into the circular groove on the dock, which aids the, in the connection feeling secure with the click-in feedback that you get once the Vivo Active is connected. Rest assured, the Vivo Active isn't going to slip easily out of the dock once it is connected. It's interesting how the dock watch experience differs between different smartwatch brands. If we were to compare how the Garmin Vivo Active 4, Fitbit Blaze and the Apple Watch Series 3 all connect to their various docks, the smartwatches will generally feel more secure with a click-in locking mechanism compared to the magnetic connection of the Apple Watch which allows for the easiest of connections of the three, and in my experience, definitely the most satisfying. Straight out of the box, the dock connector is positioned at 12 o'clock, but what the lack of instructions don't tell you is that you can reposition the connector by simply popping out at the circular portion of the dock, rotating the section to suit your preference, and then popping it back in. Something to keep in mind if you're buying this dock as a present. So that's the Cavern smartwatch charging dock for the Garmin Vivo Active 3 and 4, as well as those other Garmin smartwatches I mentioned earlier. In the description below, I'll put all of those compatible watches, as well as the Amazon link to where you can get this £10 charging dock. That will make charging your Garmin smartwatch a little less fiddly, adding that stylistic and modern look to your watch once it leaves your wrist. I hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please like and subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. That's all for me today, I'll see you on the next one. Bye! Why don't you click on one of these two videos here if you want to see my review on the Garmin Vivo Active 3 or the Vivo Active 4 before the time runs out. 3, 2, 1.